Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back. We're back to do a quick review for the Curse of Oak Island Season 8, Episode 5. Uh, we've been a while since we watched. Just kind of get away from it with everything that's been going on. We're a little bit busy. So, anyway, so we'll just do a quick review of Episode 5. Um, again, not a whole lot going on. More big investigative, uh, what's his name, Dr. Ian Spooner. They start with that. They're down near the swamp and the paved area, and they find this other area that they, they drain a little bit so they can try to get, can get in there with this metal detector or whatever. Um, they think it was like a paved, another additional area that they, look, what they say, they put rocks look like they were placed there by hand. Yeah. And they think it might be attached to the swamp somehow and they went further back and they don't know why somebody would do that. And they have all these theories about maybe somebody was buried something there or they were using it to move things from one, one place to another, like, like a road. This is where they found the paved area in the swamp, and they found another rocky area next to the swamp. Uh, it was all because of that. It was that that guy that told them it was part of the, one of those points. What he called? I forget what they called it. Because it was on that map. Yeah. Um, there was a whole bunch of names on it too. Yeah, there was. It was like a. Uh, I don't know call what he what he called, but this uh, like a menorah. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. So it was like they were checking out one of these points, and this guy told them to go dig there, and that, that's what they found. And they kind of left it. They said, okay, we're down for today. And that was pretty much it. I mean, they think they're going to, like, the first few feet down is mostly dirt and, you know, sand or whatever. So that tells you that, that somebody did it on purpose. There was no rocks whatsoever, which is a little strange. Yeah. And then they found that rocky area. So they kind of stopped that. And they weren't, they got to go back and investigate it further. I'm sure that guy was named Dr. Ian Spoon will come up with some more information or whatever in the meantime. And then they... Went back to... The money pit. Yeah, the money pit again. Digging all these little holes again, trying to find something. And, and they forget, I mean, they're down to 206 feet or something. I forget what the footage was. But they, they didn't find anything. Just more dirt and, and stuff. There's no wood or anything of great importance yeah. that they found. They, you know, they keep in the, the, the money pits there and still nothing there. But the heat going back every episode, it seems like they go back, they dig a few holes, find nothing. Or if they find something, they... Still don't really investigate it fully, which is kind of strange. Yeah, seems kind of weird. Yeah, and then that uh, the woman that forgot her name was blonde lady. It, it said she showed them a map, and there was these various points of interest on the on the island. And they're gonna go find the the first thing they went to find is you know, these rocks that were so many feet apart, exactly right line on the island. They were called the anchors, and sure enough, they yeah. went to those locations and. There was just those rocks within. They were trying to figure out if that's a, just a coincidence or if, or if the woman was right about about the map. There's all these things we do mark. There was one that was like, um, if it was on the dam. Um, I forget what else that it was on the map. I'd have to go back and try to remember each item. Anyways, they, they were investigating that. They found the rocks exactly where she said they were going to be. Uh, this episode didn't have anything of any great importance except for Gary finding that find a hinge or something to, <laughs> to say hinge to a bureau or something and and but they said it was uh there was a guy's property not too far from where they where they were standing and and he this guy who lived there was using paid a lot of things in cash apparently or what their hmm. coin or whatever back in the back then but that was like the only thing of really interest was they found a lot of dirt they found another small paved area uh, nothing where the money pit is and they found a locking thing that looked might be to a door, bureau, or whatever. And that was pretty much all that was from this this episode. Yeah. There wasn't a whole lot going on. We're gonna watch episode six, uh, and that's uh, seeing is believing to see if, if they come up with anything in addition. This uh, this episode wasn't all that exciting. I know a lot of the episodes aren't that exciting. They've, they've, there's, there's a lot of talk and theories, but very few episodes actually come with anything conclusive. So we're gonna check out the next next episode, and hopefully it's. Uh, it's a little bit bad because this one really wasn't that entertaining. Yeah. So, yeah, if you guys uh, like this video and want to see some more, put it, your thoughts down below. And as always, hit that like and subscribe. Until next time. There you go.